Good morning. It's hit shot day. with my short hair um, with the amazing and oh so lovely, so talented, so inspiring Maggie Sweets. So I'm going to head out to Maggie Sweets Photography. Um, I have an appointment at 10.15 for a session. I'm really excited about it. If you've seen any of her work, it is absolutely amazing. She did my cut of headshots, which I'll put somewhere. A like, hello. And this one too. She did both of these and I'm so happy with them. And you can just like, you, it, they just speak for themselves. She just does these incredible shots that really showcase everybody's personality. And I'm really excited to do more of like a less glam, but still very like personalized photo today. Um, and I'm really excited and thankful that she is having me in the studio today. Megan, her makeup artist, and Tanasha, her hair artist, they did my hair and makeup all of Miss South Dakota Week as well as for my headshots. And they never missed a beat, but it was perfect. So today to be doing my own hair and makeup, I'm like, oh God, I wish they were here. I wish they were here. Um, but I'll hopefully see them soon. And big, big thank you to them. If you book with Maggie, which you absolutely should, uh, <laughs> you need to get Megan and Tanasha too. They're great, they're amazing. Okay, back in the hair is a straight check. <laughs> Yay, nay. Now that I'm on my makeup, I'm going to be giving you guys a little bit of tips on uh, headshots, whether that be acting or anything else. Literally any other headshots. Okay, number one, find a headshot photographer that suits you and it suits your style. I originally got amazing headshots uh, by amazing my picture. And I just also like remember walking in and being like, make them as bright as you can. And his photos, if you've ever seen them, they are, he's leaning towards like a little bit more bright and a little bit more like dance photo-y now. But at the time he was doing like acting headshots that were a little bit more like moody lighting, warm colors. And I was like, haha, hot pink, white tank top, make me glow. And it's just kind of like, did a great job. They were bright. They were lovely. But I think I would have had more success if I went to somebody who was a bright photographer. Disappears for two minutes. So I say this in the hopes that you will do your research. Like if you look up on Instagram, headshots your area, like headshots New York, headshots Chicago, headshots LA, wherever you are, there will be a bunch, a bunch of things that pop up. Now, if you're in the Midwest, thank God you have me. You can go see Maggie. Number two, I think, is once you find your photographer, find examples of what you like on their page, in their gallery. Um, find examples of that, and so when you reach out to them, you can say, look, I, I've seen these photos in your portfolio. Uh, I'm looking, like, I'm looking for something similar, and then you know, ask them for what their rates are, if they do any discounts, if they do any bundles. Third is definitely, don't stress about it. If you were in my house last night, or in my contacts last night, <laughs> you would know that I was stressing about what I was going to wear today. Like, I went to school technically with this, like, and it was like, no patterns, like a bright color, 
or a color that really suits your skin tone, your vibe, or your what age you want to play. Really, I'm to the point now where I just I just want to capture myself on the photo. I noticed all the ones that have a screenshot, they were all wearing glasses. I'm like, maybe that's actually what I want. Steer so away from like anything crazy going on up on the top. Um, but you know, it's not like, it's not like that. It's you in a photo. Whatever you think best represents you, I say go for it. Yeah, go for it. All right, so I am here with the Maggie that I've been talking about all morning. Hi guys. We just got done shooting and it was so fun, but thank you so much. I really yes. appreciate it. She'll give you a little rundown about herself. Yes, I'm Maggie. I'm a photographer in Sioux Falls. I photograph seniors, pageants, commercial headshots, uh, which is what we were doing today for our game action headshots. We own West Sioux Studios and we rent the studio hourly um, to photographers and hobbyist photographers in our community. So feel free to come by if you're in the area as well for that or if you need headshots. Yay! Thank you so much, Mag. Yes, my pleasure. Bye, guys. Bye!